Hey, what's up, guys? My name is Santosh. Let's get started. First app is called Smart Launcher. It's smart, by the way. There are a lot of ways you can customize the launcher. You can change the themes by aligning the icons in three different ways. There are a lot of inbuilt wallpapers which are super awesome to use. And I like the feature where you can swipe up to see all the apps which are automatically sorted into categories. It does have a great interface. This one is called AP15 Launcher. It's a minimalistic launcher. I mean, once you open it, you're just gonna see all the apps rearranged according to their names. No widgets, no icons, nothing. But you can still customize by changing the font color, adding shadows and wallpapers too. Lens Launcher A unique launcher to easily access apps without any trouble. All apps are in a single page where you can magnify different areas to choose an app using your gesture. And I would say this one is pretty cool. No more confusion and this kind of satisfying. Rover's floating launcher is what I would not call it as a launcher. It's a floating icon which supports any launcher. It makes shortcuts to any apps, folders or actions. Place this floating icon anywhere and a tap would be sufficient to switch between others. Talking about tap, if you like this video, a tap on the red subscribe button would be great. AIO Launcher is not an ordinary Android launcher. It doesn't have colorful icons, many animation effects, and a variety of themes. Instead, AIO Launcher uses a screen space to show you the most important information. The home screen shows system monitor, RAM, and the percentage of battery power. Computer Launcher, as the name suggests, is a launcher based on Windows theme. It has a built-in support windows like File Explorer and File Manager. Listing of all of your drives, SD card, storage, audio and your video files in PC style. You also get a lot of themes to try for free. CPL Launcher is the second generation pixel launcher home screen with a lot of settings. It comes with deep customization options. It's fast and looks clean and minimal. You can also choose dark, white, black and some more themes. So that's it for today guys. The video has come to an end. If you like this video, make sure to subscribe. And this video took me almost a week in making. And signing up a Santosh from your smart tech, do it unique. That don't don't shake her. Oh bitch, you know I'm grinding like a pro skater. Baby mama bugging, I'm so quick to hit ignore. Buku bitch, in my bed. I got scales all on.